essentials. It's all in one packet. You pour it into a glass, add eight ounces of water, and that makes it isotonic. Funny, that's the name, isotonic. The importance about isotonic is that as soon as it hits your stomach, the stomach identifies it as it's ready to be absorbed and immediately drops it into the small bowel. 97% of what you take will be delivered to the small bowel ready for absorption. As opposed to a pill, you're lucky if you get 40%. Most of the studies show that many of the pills that we currently have are made in China. Many of them don't even have the ingredients that they're supposed to have. So you get 40% of nothing. Okay, next one. So Nutrametrics, Nutrametrics is the physician line and they have the same uh, supplements and nutrients. They can be packaged in a, in a way that uh, may be particular for that doctor's practice. If he's, a, if he's an orthopedic doctor, it may be focused primarily on the bone and joint supports and different combinations of such. If he's a vascular doctor, then it's gonna be associated with vascular health. If he's an endocrinologist, then most of these can be adjusted for things like diabetes or high blood pressure, things that he might be treating, adrenal insufficient, uh, uh, adrenal disease. And thirdly, one of my favorite is aloe. And you know, uh, I'm, I'm an expert. Because I'm Hispanic, I'm an expert on aloe because everybody knows Hispanics love aloe. <laughs> Honestly, I mean, I tell you, I, I think most Hispanics even wash their car with aloe. But you know, it comes from our mothers and our grandmothers. They knew that aloe was good. But I'm just gonna tell you, our aloe is not our grandmother's aloe. Our aloe, the, the, from the harvesting to the concentration, it's resulted in over a 200% concentration of particular entities, which before five to 10 years ago were not in aloe because of the way that it was harvested and the way it was processed. And these, pro and these entities actually improve your immune function. They improve the cellular immune function. That means cells called macrophages and monocytes. And I'm gonna tell you, those are very important in viral diseases. I treat pulmonary patients. If anyone knew me from two years ago, they would tell you, Dr. Forrest gets an upper respiratory infection four or five times a year. I was always the runny nose kid. I was always sickly. I've been on aloe, I take it twice a day. I just put it in my water, I drink it throughout the day. I haven't had an upper respiratory infection in a year and a half. So uh, I'm just gonna say that aloe has over 200 different, it's got antioxidants in it. The good thing is it's a great source of B12 and it's one of the only sources of, of uh, vegetable-based B12 for people that are vegetarians. So uh, it has a variety of antioxidants. It's got the minerals that work as cofactors with your enzymes for enzymatic uh, machinery. Uh, heart health, omegas, very important. Omegas, I, know I hate these things because they're huge, but these are very important. They actually compete with, ends, with, uh, with bad fats to s limit the amount of inflammation. In other words, we eat a whole lot of bad fats, omega-3s, and omega-6s are a lot better for us. And so when we take omega-6s, and omega-3s, when, when we take the good omegas, it overpowers the machinery that creates inflammation from the, bad, from the bad omegas, which are all in our biscuits and all in our processed foods. And so these omega-3s are not only, it's important that when you buy omega-3s, that you buy a bottle that doesn't let the sunlight in, because the sunlight will make these omegas rancid. And rancid omega-3s is like taking free radicals. So you're taking what you're trying to prevent. It's important that you buy in small quantities because you want them fresh. The older they are, the more likely they're to, to go rancid, which has more free radicals. Our product has vitamin E in there, which is an antioxidant to keep the free radicals from occurring. And in fact, if you look, some of the cheaper ones, they go out and they buy a big old jug at, at Kroger's or Walmart, and they say, look what I got for five bucks. That's great. I say, take them back, get your money back, give me half, we'll be, you'll be way ahead. Why? Because the cheaper omega-3s are, are made from larger fish. And large fish are predatory fish. Predatory fish concentrate PCBs and toxins. Our omegas come off of deep water, cold, small fish off the coast of Argentina. And so ours are chemically tested. There are no PCBs, no toxins in ours. They're as pure as you can be, made from small, non-predatory fish. 
So omega-3s, I hate swallowing them, but they're very important. And with that, that brings us to an end. I'm gonna just refer you to Dr. Ed's Health or Else uh, on Facebook. I've got several articles there. Soon we're gonna have a webpage that you can go to. You'll be able to see some videos and uh, see some of the patients and doctors that are currently having their horizons broadened. Thank you very much, you've been a great audience. Woo!